The company that runs the food stands at Arrowhead and Kauffman Stadiums cited for 20 violations of the city's health code. Wow, and the evidence is coming from one of their own food service managers. KBC 9's Michael Mahoney has the latest. Michael? Len, ESPN's Outside the Lines broadcast is breaking this story. It was first aired about 30 minutes ago. In it, the whistleblower is a food safety manager here at the stadium that says that both stadiums and their food stands have problems with mold, bugs, and bad practice. John Costa says this cup full of bugs is part of the problem at the food stands at the sports complex. Both stadiums. Here's another picture, he says, of dead bugs and a bottle of alcohol. He turns these pictures over to the Kansas City Health Department. This is not common, actually. We have never, I don't think I ever witnessed anything like this before. Johari says they checked 26 stands from both stadiums and found violations at 20 of them. Costa submitted pictures of the sinks where employees are supposed to wash their hands, often filled up with other things or just plain blocked. He had pictures showing food not being kept at its proper temperatures. In the ESPN report, Costa says he repeatedly told his superiors about the problems. Aramark says he was a food safety manager, so he should have done something. A statement from Aramark says the health inspectors revisited the stadium on Monday and found no issues or violations. The health department, however, says that there are still some outstanding issues from the first inspection on November the 3rd. Until now, the health department says inspectors would check food preparation before and during every game. Jahari says the mess they found in some places looked like when the games were over, the employees just flipped off the lights and left. How often do you inspect after a game or, or late in the game during the cleanup after the event? After the game, we never thought, actually, to go back and inspect after the game. Now the health department says that from the, here on out, they will also inspect the food stands when the games are over. And Aramac, the vendor here, says, by the way, that the whistleblower, Costas, is now on paid administrative leave. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News. Going to the Chiefs game on Sunday, coming up at 6, what must be done so the food concession stands can open at Arrowhead for Sunday's football game?